Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to fix the issue where your mp4 files are not importing inside of DaVinci. Now there's a couple of reasons why this could be the case. Now the first thing is you want to come and check your file name of your video as there are certain characters that are basically just not accepted inside of DaVinci. So the first thing I'd recommend doing is just coming over to your video and then renaming the file to something simple and then you can try re-importing the file to see if that fixes the issue. Now if that doesn't work what we're going to do is head over to the DaVinci application and then once you're inside of the DaVinci application we need to head over to DaVinci Resolve in the top left here and you're just going to select check for updates as sometimes outdated software can also cause this issue. So once you've ensured you're fully up to date here, the very last thing we can do if that's still not fixed the issue is you'll need to come over to your start menu and then just search for Microsoft Store. So inside of the Microsoft Store, we're gonna search for VLC Space Player and hit enter. And then you'll need to go ahead and install the VLC Media Player. Now, once you've got this on your computer, we're just gonna launch up the application. And now we're inside of the VLC Media Player, we need to come over to Media in the top left here and come down to convert and save then inside of this file selection we just need to hit the add button and then you'll need to locate the mp4 video that you're trying to import into davinci so i'm going to double click on my mp4 here and then come down to the bottom and select convert and save now inside of here you need to come to this profile drop down and it's very important that we select this top one here which is video h.264 plus mp3 you can then come down to destination file and hit browse and this is basically where we want the video to be saved to. So I'm going to keep it inside of my videos folder and hit save. And then we can just press start to start the process. And then you'll just need to wait a couple of seconds for this process to complete. And that's it guys. Now when we import the MP4 over to DaVinci, you can see it now imports successfully without any errors. And it's really as simple as that. If this video did help you, then please consider dropping a like and subscribing. Until next time.